Okay, just a heads up before I start. I am a little breathy. I have got a baby coming any day now, and I'm out of breath. So, um, also my lighting kind of sucks because I'm doing this at 7:45 at night. But I wanted to make sure I got this all like shown to you guys and explained to you guys, so you guys can maybe hit some old navy sales before they're over. So, excuse the lighting, excuse the breathy voice, but I've got some good deals to show you guys. anything about Old Navy's outlet sales you know they are even better than their regular store sales. In fact I have probably 10 feet of a receipt, no joke, right here, of the 76 items that I bought and I'm going to just kind of show you what I got. So <clears throat> it doesn't look like a lot but it, it is. So, I got all of this. Um, there are 76 items here, and I paid $291, and all of this is worth $1,000 um, based on the original um, price on the tag. Okay, so um, Old Navy does a lot of sales, but if you watch, they do a sale at the beginning of the year for 70 up to 75% off. Now, if you go to the outlets, they, um, towards the end of January, they take an extra 30% off of 75% off. So, um, I'll show you a couple of things that I bought. Okay, so my biggest prized item, I should say. So I bought this for the baby. I saw it was on sale because I saw the orange sticker. That's all I look for when I'm shopping at Old Navy is I look for the orange sticker and then I go to the scanner and I scan it because I know the outlet adds an additional. So I found this cute little hat and I saw the orange sticker and I thought, well, I might as well see how much it was. I paid 32 cents, 32 cents for this hat. So mind blowing. Um, so socks, let's see, let me see what I can find. These little baby booties had, they were marked like this for $10, but I ended up paying five for them. <clears throat> so here's another example. These were marked down to 97 cents. These rang up at 67 cents for these. <laughs> Same with this one. One of these shirts under here. You can see it's marked 97 cents. Um, I scanned it and I paid 67 cents. $1.49 plus an additional 30% off. Um, they even had their graphic tees like these. They are $15. They were on sale for 10, so they weren't that great, but I did grab two of them because um, I had Sophie with me and she picked this one out and then there was one that I knew Xander would like. Um, let's see what else I can find. Oh, these hats. Let's see. They didn't have the orange tag, at least this one doesn't. This one had the orange tag. And it showed 347. It rang up at 147. Same with these water bottles, priced at 349. They came up at a dollar or something, 299. But it came up cheaper. Um, some of them would say like 1099, but if you scanned them, they were down to only a couple of dollars. These joggers were 10, or say 10 on them, and then they ring up a seven. So all of this is a thousand dollars worth based on the original price tag. And so the trick is, is just to go, if you go to the outlets, I mean the stores and stores have these deals, um, just the orange sticker deals, which are set up to 75% off. But if you go to the outlet, then you will get an additional percentage off of this. So I go to the Park City outlets 
and I basically just start looking for the orange stickers. As soon as I see the orange stickers, I go to their self um, scanners and I just start scanning to see how much more of a discount they come down to. So for example, this is a men's t-shirt, $1.47, and then plus an additional 30% off. Um, these women's joggers, they say $7.99. I think I paid $5.40 or something like that. Um, baby outfit, $6.99. I can't remember how much it rang up to. But they have things that are like, I mean, not only are you getting really nice joggers and a nice t-shirts and things like that, but they've got these like fleece lined hoodies, um, coats, all this kind of stuff. So if you live near an outlet, definitely check out their sale towards the end of January because it's totally worth it. Do you recommend going up a size depending on, I mean, if you've shopped Old Navy, um, then you probably know. I personally think they run small. So I always buy a size ahead. Now this is all for my kids for next winter. I do have a couple of things that are short sleeve because they were just on sale. So I did buy them for the summer, but I always like to buy a season ahead. And so I buy like the hoodies and things like that, a size bigger. Same with the summer stuff, but just because I know Old Navy, um, for me, I think they shrink and then they run a little bit smaller. So I take all, I'm gonna take all these get all the tags off. I'm going to throw them in the in the washer and dryer and get them shrunk and then take a look at what will fit, you know, maybe something shrunk a little bit smaller than I expected so it might fit now. Um, what will fit in the summer and then what will fit in next fall winter. So I always shop the season ahead for my kiddos. Just makes it nice. I usually can buy almost all of my boys tops or jackets and um, shirts at this old navy sale. Um, a lot of times you can find shoes on sale. I've gotten shoes as cheap as $1.50 for my kiddos, but at this outlet, um, at this time, they didn't have their shoes marked down. So I was a little bummed. I mean, they had them marked down, but not enough. And if they were marked down enough, they weren't the sizes I needed for the girl or boy um, gender colored that I needed. So I didn't get any shoes. I was a little bit bummed about that, but um, I was happy that I was able to get what I did. This is my receipt. It's literally super long. Plus this one because they can only scan like 65 items at a time. And then I tried writing down what I originally paid for things and then what, or the original price and then what I paid for it. But as you can see, I kind of got done with it. I was like over it because there was just so many items. But Oh man, I got something spilled on it. But after adding all of this up, um, it would have cost a thousand dollars for the seventy-six item based on the original price, and I paid two ninety-nine. If you don't live by an outlet, definitely check your Old Navy just near you because they do have good deals. And I mean, like looking at these price tags, even at ninety-seven cents or a dollar forty-nine, that's still a great deal for a shirt or you know for shorts and pants like the this says $5.99 for a pair of pajamas is great I ended up getting it cheaper because of the outlet additional but definitely um, if you're not near an outlet outlet definitely check the regular store now to take the price tags off and get these all washed and stored in the kids bins so that they are ready for when they go up a size.